The new EFCC chairman comes on board at a time the federal government is implementing reforms in the fight against corruption in the country. The task before Olao Lukayode, the task says, will start with the National Assembly. Sifon Desien takes a look at the headship of the EFCC. The eye survey. The nomination of Mr. Ola Olukoyede is hereby confirmed as chairman of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC. The confirmation of Ola Olukoyede as chairman of Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, comes with lots of expectations. The EFCC chairman emphasized the need for the commission to redirect its focus as an anti-corruption agency. The mandate given to EFCC was given to EFCC by law. Any attempt to do anything outside that mandate is going to be deemed as also violating the provision of the law. I was also an officer in the Temple of Justice. We are going to do our work diligently with utmost respect to the provisions of the law. You can't fight anti-corruption uh, successfully without respect to the provisions of the law. I make that pledge before you, sir. I'd like to use this opportunity on behalf of myself. Mr. Olukoyede takes over from Mr. Abdul Karim Chuko, who served as the acting chairman of the commission. Having the participants. He previously served as chief of staff to Mr. Ibrahim Magu, who was the acting executive chairman at the time. The anti-corruption agency has come a long way, starting with Nuhu Ribadu as the pioneer chairman following its establishment in 2002. From above. Mr. Ola Olukoyede comes on board as the ninth head of the EFCC. Sifon Essien, TVC News, Abuja.